What's up, buddy? Where'd you- where'd you- Oh! Oh, I hate that. Get really here. You oh. can look at the little stuff. You're gonna look at how- There's an Entendra hiding in there somewhere. Yeah. That was a good Stargate. Uh-huh. Stargate. Eh. Come on. So she didn't like that it dealt with emotion or with with her supposed short term memory loss. Uh -huh. Well, when you do that, you think I guess as a kid you're like, oh, it's funny, and they can't figure it out. And I I can't say because I haven't seen it, but mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that it feels like dealt with wrongly. It might be might make you feel offensive. bad. Well, but, maybe not offensive. Like but, here's but an example. Not. Here's an example. M. Night Shyamalan Split, yeah, which is apparently very good, and I, I absolutely will eventually watch that one. Go take that, take a peek at that. I'm just worried because, like, historically in film, multiple personality is not dealt with well. No, I'm gonna get it this time. Hang tight. Eh, come on. But that's because most people are like, oh, it's schizophrenia. It's not. It's, it's not schizophrenia. It's not the same. In fact, They're not. Completely different. That's not even close. And I just <laughs> look. I, okay, I graduated with a bachelor's in math, um, and there is a movie, a very famous movie uh, about mathematician John Nash called *A Beautiful Mind*. And you watch it in high school, and it's about the guy who pioneered game theory and all these techniques and his struggles with uh, schizophrenia, and that's a big deal for him. Oops, mm -hmm. that's a big deal for him. But it becomes basically all about his schizophrenia, and there's a couple of, like, numbers-style scenes yeah, where he like, uses it oh, to get look. girls and he uses math to be cool, and I get, like... Yeah. I do... I like math. I don't use it as much as I did, but... You know, you're really <laughs> avoiding those, those lies. One up. I'm all about it. With zero lives left. I'm all about danger. <laughs> all about living in the moment. Oh, God, it's going to be a pain in the ass when I have to pick up 100 coin stars later. Yeah, it is. Eh. Uh, I don't know. It, it felt... Yeah. Well, I understand where you're coming from with the whole... It, it should have been more dealing with the math than it was about his schizophrenia. Well, I mean, if it's going to be about the schizophrenia, do it. But I'm not really a fan of, like, Oscar bait stuff. Mm. Like, look at this math, but no, it's, it's... Look at this math, but let me tell you about that... This gets pretty... <laughs> about well, my think... ginger roommate that nobody else can see. <laughs> uh, Watch the movie. It's... Totally. Watch the movie. It's... Where am I going? What do I have left? Stop. Oh, no, the last one's extremely difficult. Because I, I liked that movie. That uh, was a good movie. It's, it's okay. There are, there are scenes that just make it wonderful. Where can I pick up one-ups? Let's go do the hundred coin in here. Boop. Um, as far as, as far as mental illnesses in movies, you look at people like the Joker, mm -hmm. and I, I don't know. I mean, like, all Batman villains are basically people with mental disorders. Okay. Which isn't a good thing. Okay. But it's not a bad thing. I mean, well, given it, I mean, I, I'll, the first one that came to mind was the Penguin and then the Riddler, and I'm I'm not making the connection. With mental disorders? Yes. Well, with Penguin, it's more of a physical disorder of his Being... webbed hands and. Oh, yes, for real? Yeah, for real. That's spoopy. Or like his webbed toes. Uh huh. I mean, he was he was horribly disformed. That's sad. And, uh, he also has narcissism. Mm -hmm. Or at least narcissistic tendencies. Mm. But that that could easily come from the exorbitant amount of wealth that he had. Oh, uh, yeah. Get rich, that just happens. Yeah. So what's the Riddler's backstory, then? I am not up to date uh, in my Batman footwear. I... I'm not sure. I know that he was played by, uh... Jim Carrey? No. What? Other guy. Um, the, uh, Riddler. the Riddler was played by Mark Hamill. Oh, you're talking way back. Way back. Jim Carrey, too. Yes, you're correct. Yes, I am familiar with the Jim Carrey variety. That was the Clooney, wasn't it? Eh. Gotta love <laughs> that Clooney. Yeah. Them sweet bat nipples. <laughs> Gotta get them bat nipples. Oh, I'm su I should be going for coins here, like I said I would be. Instead, I'm talking about bat nipples. I mean... 
Why wouldn't we? <sighs> Boom. I just... Yeah? You've seen, uh... The Bad Batman. And uh, you know exactly which one I'm talking about. Is it the Clooney Batman? Or uh, is it... it is the Clooney Batman, but, uh... Batman Forever, I believe it's called. Oh, yeah. No, Batman and Robin. Yeah. They're both, they're na neither of them are very good. Neither of them are very good. Not that, not that I disliked them as a kid, but as I grew more mature, I was like, what, what even? Oh my, mm, <laughs> stop it. Oof. That, that was always my struggle. There's a lot of movies from my childhood that are just awful, that I love. I have, that I just don't hold up. Yeah. And they need to put warning signs on that crap. Um, I have a slowly growing... Look at you like, oh god. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> there is a slowly growing uh, subset of movies that I've I've watched, rewatched as, uh, as an adult, I loved as a kid, mm -hmm, that mm -hmm. are going into this movie graveyard of things that are no longer uh, nostalgically fun to watch because they weren't good movies, and yeah. th the mayor of that graveyard is, is named Osmosis Jones. Osmosis Jones. <laughs> it's, it's so it's, bad now. It's very difficult, and I... It feels like... Well, you I know, don't need to justify... <laughs> you know what really doesn't hold up? This is... This you, game. You right know, now. I'm working on it. Uh, no, you know what really doesn't hold up? Yes. Osmosis Jones, the TV series. I Okay, I had to be reminded while I was watching it that Ozzy and Rix was a thing. Yeah. So that it, that threw me for a loop. Eh. I, I just, I, it never made any sense to me. That he just stays in, in the like, butt and they fight bad guys? Yeah, well, it, it's like, hey look, you got bit by a mosquito and for some reason the mosquito left you behind in this particular... What would have happened? I don't like, know. That's, that's I think that's a better story. Um, oh, about why the mosquito left the whatever behind? No, about why the mosquito left. Uh, no, what would have happened to them if, if they would have stayed in the mosquito? Oh, so they go into the mosquito. Yeah. That's messed up. So they just, they just stay in the mosquito. I wanna. That, I wanna. I mean, it's not a great movie. I'm not, I'm not no, saying it's, it's not. Like an it's Oscar just winner. like. I think it's a better story than. Now we're in a 15-year-old boy. Oh, fudge. Is that what he's in, really? Oh, my God. <sighs> Is that yeah. what he's in, for real? Yeah, he's, like, in a, in a prepubescent child. Yeah. And... Oh, and they can yeah. have the girl to talk. Yeah. I'm gonna shoot him. Oh, my God! <laughs> I'm so, I should have practiced a little bit. You feeling? You feeling it? I'm feeling it. It's, you're gonna when it's your turn. I just can't. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you play with me. Oh, no, I don't know. You don't like it. Oof. Well. You decide what we're playing yet? Huh? You decide what we're playing yet? Um, it'll either be God of War or um, Uncharted. Is that is that the one where like? You can parachute or something, and there's like all these modes of transport. Uh, no, that's that's uh just cause. Inglorious. That's what it is. I don't know my games. I'm not a huge fan of Just Cause, but then again, I've only ever played the third game and yep. not very much of it. Uh huh. Um, his accent took me for a loop, which sounds horribly racist, but what kind of accent is it? Uh, third worldian. Oh, that's why. <sighs> Oh. oh! Oh, I did not know that was a thing that could happen. That's new. Again, that should take away, like, half your health bar. I did. I did pretty good. Um, if I don't hit that, I'm deceased. Well, and I, I didn't feel invested in the story because they didn't give... Sit, sit, sit! Ooh, they didn't get, give me a good job of, like, this is what we've accomplished so far. And I know that I hate that in games that I've played... Like a previously on segment for games? Yeah. Eh. But, on the other hand, 
like it's a new installment on the PS4. It's not like yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm getting at. This story has no conclusion. <laughs> this and story has no punchline. Just upset. Uh, you can be mad. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I've never done that. Oh, get eh. that, get that, get that wood. Get you just gotta... Stop it with this garbage. <laughs> Take me out of first person view, please. Alright, we're fine. We're gonna need more coins than is up here, but that's a start. Eh. Well, you're at 82, so you're not doing terrible. I know, but I. 100 coin stars take a ton of my concentration. I know. There they are. Eight. We need eight. Let's go kill something. Stop! Oh! Why don't you grab that five right next to you? That go to sleep first. Just take a chill pill. There we go. Yeah. 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 Alright, three, come on. Let's get the five that's just sitting right there on, on top of that mopper. Uh two. Or three. Three. Oh, that'll do it. Eh. Come on, did oh, I really that's... think that was worth five? Oh, that's only worth two. That's only worth two. Nah, blue coins are worth a crazy amount of money. This is... Oh. There. Here's what I want. I just gotta be careful, because he's gonna spawn right where... I don't want the star to be. Eh. This is right, 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 awfully right, right. sassy. You can't afford to get hit again. There we go. Oh! Don't let my guard down. Oh, shit. <laughs> Not happening. Alright, that's... Oh. I think that's lunch. I have sweaty palms.